getting ready for baseball under the roof and in now, Houston. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend series Houston, between the Minnesota Astros. Twins and the Houston Astros. Stay tuned for Astros baseball next. Colin McHugh gets the ball in game three of the series. What do you have for us on him, H? Well, if you're wondering why he's had a good year, he points to one number for me. They're batting under 250. Everybody, righties, lefties, switch hitters, whoever's coming at him. And when you're able to keep that number under 250, you're giving your team a chance to win games. And we'll see if he can do that in this one. Batting second, left fielder. At the plate, Goose, Goose Dirtbag. Dirt he went deep in the contest last night. First pitch coming, here it is. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Harold, these twins, as they take the field here this afternoon, they come in scuffling a bit of late, just two and four over their last six games. Yeah, last game, they just didn't play well. They gave up a lot of runs, really sloppy. So when you play that sloppy, you're not going to win games. Can't get him to chase. It's one and two. There's that tight slider right there. Just missed getting under the hands. That's a good pitch. I like that pitch. But if you don't get it where you want it, it could be a dangerous pitch to throw. And he got him. Digging in for his second at bat. Goose dirtbag. 0 for 1 here in the early going. And that one swung on and missed 0 and 1. Bottom of inning number three, nothing, nothing, our score. And I'm not sure, but it looks like he may have been blindfolded for that swing. It's 0-2 now. After that swing, you just got to reset yourself. You still have a strike to work with, and you, you can't be thinking about how silly you just looked on that last pitch. Hey, you can do it. No one better. Let's go. The 0-2 once more. Oh, look out! Hot shot to third, and there are two away. So here's Joe Maurer. He's 0 for 1 thus far. First baseman. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Correa onto the grass. Uh oh, he whiffs on it. Riding in once again, Goose Dirtbag. He'll start things out in the home half of inning number five. Dirtbag. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Grossman racing back, but he can't get it as it's off the wall. And the Astros get something started right away. It's a leadoff double. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. Jose Good lead off a second there. Now the pitch. Chopped weakly to the left. And the throw is not going to be in time as he's able to reach base safely. Well, that's called smelling a base hit right there. He beats out an infield single. Not everybody hustles out of the box, but he darn sure knew he better, and he did. Ready once again, Brian Dozier. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. Dozier. Hey, come on, guys. The 0 and 1 delivery. Now Dozier with a drive out to left field. It's up and out of here into the archways. Looking at that pitch again, you can see he just flat out. Digging in and looking for more. Deuce. Dirtbag. We'll see if he can come through in a clutch spot here. Two on, two out here in inning number six. Pulled toward right center field. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will. Digging in once again. Goose Dirtbag. And a big at bat in this one. Two on, two away here in the eighth. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. This is a critical point right here. Things are in danger of getting away from him a little, so we'll see how he deals with it. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Santana ranging back, and it's gone! Santana. 
So a three-run shot to left center. Fourth home run for him on the season as it is now 7-3. to three. I know height sight's 20-20, but you can't throw that pitch to that guy. Don't forget, he homered yesterday, so you know he's locked in. And... Here's Brian Dozier now. He went deep to the tune of a three-run job his last time up. The 0-1 on its way. Here's a shot to left field and deep. Look at this. A leap, but he can't bring it back into the park. It's a home run. 7-4 the final finish today. Colin McHugh earned his ninth win of the year, permitting only two hits in six complete innings. So that's it for us this afternoon. For Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, log on to theshownation.com. Fans, our final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious... And in a tie ball game late, they're going to make a move here as we'll see a pinch runner come on at first base. Here's George Springer. Two for Center three with a double on his four. line so far. George Springer. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one. Hit the other way out toward right field. Under it is Cruz now for route number two. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. So two gone now in the Houston eighth. And striding in the speedy second baseman, Jose Altuve. Altuve. He's ready. Here's the 0-2 pitch. A swinging bunt out in front of the plate. He's got to hurry. On to first. And this will remain a tie ball game as the inning is over. One left for Houston. Score remains deadlocked at 2-2. Two -two. Ready for another chance? Kyle Seeger. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Ready to deliver the one and two. And that's lifted the other way out to left. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Into the box, Goose Dirtbag. Left fielder, Goose Dirtbag. Looking good, looking good. Going better up there. Here's the first pitch. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dyson racing back. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the... The big bat tonight for the Astros belonged to this man, Cameron Maben. Don't put that card in your bicycle spokes. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, he came through with a multi-hit game, and more importantly, they were big hits. He was a key contributor to the outcome of this one. Three to two, the finish in Fans tonight's game. The Astros. Tonight. First for the 
Tuesday night baseball now from the home of the Astros Minute Maid Park in Houston tonight the second of three second baseman Altuve and Cano next on the show. Charlie Morton is on the mound for game two. HR what's the word on him. Well Matt he's really had a tough time his last three outings ERA over nine that's basically giving up a run an inning. He just has really struggled and not been able to figure it out. They're giving him the ball though and anytime you get the ball you got a chance to turn it around. We'll see if today's the day he turns it around. Striding in goose dirt bag. It lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. And HR, you take a look at these Seattle Mariners entering play here tonight. They come in in the midst of a stretch where they've dropped six of their last nine. Yeah, Matt, it's been a little bit of a struggle. One and three on the road trip. You never want to be in that position. But you try to pick up as many wins as you possibly can. That's why this game today is important. Ready to deliver the one and two. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Time now for a quick look at the hometown Astros starting lineup. Danny, any thoughts? Well, fellas, there's nobody that I'm more excited to watch play than Carlos Correa. He doesn't let the pressure of the big moment get to him. I love watching this guy hit in clutch situations. It's like he takes a deep breath and everything. Digging in for his second at no bat. Matter. Goose Left dirt field. bag. 0 for Goose. 1 here in the early dirt going. Bag. First pitch on its way from Gallardo. Hit sharply on the ground. And that's just past the grasp of Cano in the center, a base hit. The two out hit means Carlos Correa will bat this inning. That's what you call going to the play with a game plan. 0 oh, 0 oh, count, looking for a fastball. He took it right oh, back batting. up the middle. Great nice execution. Shortstop. A check at the bag by Gallardo. Oh, and he just manages to get his hand in. He's set. Here's the three and two. And a fastball swung on and missed, and the side is retired. Here's Leonis Martin. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. Leonis Martin. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Dirtbag is right there as he'll put it away without much problem for the second out. Stepping in and ready for another no shot. Goose dirtbag. One for two on his line bag. so far in the game. Oh, Chief, what time? Here we go. First delivery to him on the way. Swing and a little Let's blooper go, 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 to center. Halfway, halfway here. Cano onto the grass. One away. Here's the third baseman now, Kyle Seeger. His career numbers in this matchup, nine base hits in 22 tries. Two of those hits were for home runs. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Dirtbag is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. Ready for another shot now. Goose, dirtbag. Left fielder, Goose, dirtbag. First pitch of the at bat. And this is off the glove of Ruiz as it bounds away. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. Come on, guy. Get your pitch up there. The 0 1. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings. Big power swings. Now he's got to dial it back a little bit and try to put that ball in play. Inside as that perhaps will back him off a bit. One and two. There's that tight slider right there. Just missed getting under the hands. That's a good pitch. I like that pitch. But if you don't get it where you want it, it could be a dangerous pitch to throw. Now a ball rolled softly to second. Going to be a tough play. And indeed, he'll take only the out at first as the run comes in to score. Ready once again. Goose dirt bag. Fielder. Goose dirt bag.
Here comes the first pitch. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. Faces are empty, one man out. Oh, got him to swing out of his shoes on that one. Nothing in two. I really like how the catcher and the pitcher are reading swings. The pitch before, big power swing. Then they pull the string on him and get him out in front early. He has no idea what's coming now. Good pitch there on 0-2. Breaking ball out of the zone away. Might set up another breaking ball to see if he'll chase this one a little bit farther off the plate. And you wonder about the control now as he misses high with the slider. Shot foul over towards the coaching box. That's a big fastball, obviously, and we're going to see this reliever throw it a lot. Hey, let her fly, kid. Let her fly. And that is swung on and missed, and things are starting to look bleak here for the home nine. There are two away now. Didn't look to me like that was much of a protect swing with two strikes. No, he was trying to go yard, two strikes or not kind of looks bad if you strike out like he did though I'm sure his manager would have liked for him to focus on getting on base you might think it's just another win but it's awfully hard to win in this game especially on the road but they find a way to get it done and they should be very happy and now time is called here with the potential tying run over at first they're not going to take any chances as they've made the move to a pinch runner now Digging in once again, George Springer, leadoff man on base, and George. we'll see what they have in mind strategy-wise here. And a dive, but he's back in there. Both teams with six hits so far. Hey, your turn. Drive him in. Watch up for us. He's going. Runners off for second. Swing and a miss. Strike three. The throw way late, and he's in there easily at second. So stepping in, Jose Altuve, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. He's set. Here's the 2-2. Runner breaks for third. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Throw just in time as he was flying down the line that time. But not in time. And just like that, this ball. Digging in the switch hitter, Goose. Dirt bag. No official that bat for him, but he has scored a run in this one. First pitch cutter that's by him for strike one. Oh, oh, he tried to end it right there. One big swing here in this extra inning game. The 0 and 1 delivery. A swing and a miss at the big curveball. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings. Big power swings. Now he's got to dial it back a little bit and try to put that ball in play. A uh, great pitch there as he couldn't get extended on that one, and he's down on strikes for the second out. Just tied him up with that last pitch. Pretty evident by the swing. Sometimes guys get in that protect mode so much that they're swinging at everything that they see, and they end up offering it pitches that they can't possibly do anything with. Striding in once again, uh, next for the Goose Astro. Dirtbag, over for one with a run Goose. scored thus far. Dirtbag. Let's go, big dog. Here's the first pitch. Now a swing and a ball chopped foul right at home plate. The 0-1. Now a late bunt attempt here, but he misses strike two. Possible winning run aboard here. Nobody out. Hey, right guy, right place. Here we go. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and two. As a look, now the pitch. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Oh, he might have got away with one. Two strike breaking ball that ends up being in the zone. I think he probably won that out of the zone, but fortunately, he just fouled it off. Ready with another two strike offering. And a good sinker there gets him swinging for the first down. Well, it's been a rough series for him at the plate so far. That's four strikeouts in the first two games. So this pitching staff clearly has him figured out.
Here's the catcher, Carlos Ruiz. 0 for 4 for with a strikeout thus catcher, far. Carlos Ruiz. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. In the air to left. Dirtbag is in pursuit. He's got it one away. And the Astros offensively were led this afternoon by this guy, Carlos Beltran. What a performance he turned in. He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, he played a nice game out there, as did some of his teammates, but he seemed to be the biggest difference maker, so he gets the nod in this one. A one-run game this afternoon, 3-2 to two the final finish. Chris Davinsky earns the victory in relief in this one, his seventh of the year. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Harold Reynolds and Dan Plezak and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. Afternoon. To find out more, First head on over to the show. A player is addressed about a troubling trend in his plate performance of late. The coach advocates a more disciplined approach. MLB The Show has baseball coming your way on a summer night at Oriole Park in Baltimore. Tonight, the first of this three-game weekend series between the American League's Houston Astros and the Baltimore Orioles. Two of the game's best overall talents, Altuve and Machado, next. Kevin Gossman will be on the mound for the series opener. What do we need to know here, HR? Well, it hasn't been a great year for him so far. I mean, he's had some ups and some downs. He's had some decent games, some poor games. An ERA in the fours. That tells me the story of his season has been inconsistency. Stepping up to the plate, Goose Dirtbag. He begins playing this Goose. one with his batting average Dirtbag. over the 310 plateau. Let it fly. Let's go right here. And right First here pitch of the at bat on its way. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Harold, one of your former uniforms, the Orioles, as they begin play here tonight. They have not been playing their best baseball of late as they've dropped four of their last five. Well, Matt, I mean, the simple way to put it, they lost their last game. This is where baseball comes the best to me, where all the cliches come in. You got to have a short term memory and you really do. The game's over. You can't do anything about it. You got to come back today and play better and win.
Hey, let it fly up there, huh? He's ready. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Another one sent. He gets something he wants to hit. The next 0-2. Lays off that time, and it's 1-2. and two. Let it rip right here. We need you. Hey, lucky kid. Here he there, comes kid. on a ball and two strikes. And a swing and a ball hit foul heading for the seats. So another foul ball here and it remains one and two. Now another one two. A swing and a miss on a ball way out of the zone and there's one away. Now here's a look at the Astros starting lineup. Anybody catch your eye Dan? Well you really have to appreciate what Jose Altuve brings to this team. He's working on a six game hit streak right now. That's almost a week. So I expect to see his hot hitting continue. On, Digging in to try it again. Howdy. Goose Left dirt field. bag. 0 for Goose. 1 here in the early dirt going. Bag. Let's go, kid. One tie right here. Here's the first pitch to him. Here's the first pitch chopped foul right at home plate, and that's the first strike. Throw over to the bag. Runner back safely. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. And this one gets away. And you can forget about the double play now as the runner moves up to second base. Hey, your pitch right here. Let's go. Ready to deal. Here's the 1-1. One, 1-1 one. One, one pitch is a slider one, that's two. cut on and missed for strike two. Hey, so far in this five, game, five, he's eight. the only guy in the lineup that's gone down on strikes. Yeah, and he might strike out for a second time right here. Swing, and that's hit out of play up into the plaza level. Hey, let it rip one time. Hey, grip it and rip it, kid. Grip it and rip it. And this one gets away. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. Has a look. Now the pitch. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. No one can make a play on this one. And the first Astros hit is going to be for extra bases. And the run will score as the Astros are off to the early 1-0 lead. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Here's the 1-2 and two delivery. And now the runner's trying for third. Hit the other way out toward right field. We'll reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move. And that ends the inning. To settle. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Goose dirtbag. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. Swung right over the splitter there, 0 and 1. That was a good pitch right there, started. Anthony's got the hard sink down, got him to swing right through it. Beautiful. Here's the 0 1 pitch. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. Great spot with that pitch down and away. He'll be fine coming out of the bullpen in this one if he can keep hitting that spot. Let it rip right here. Let's go. Now the 0-2 pitch. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back-to-back -back punch outs here to the first two men. Here's Chris Davis now. He'll start things out here in the home fifth. Leading and it's been Orioles. tough sledding for this lineup Chris, through the play. first half of the game. Chris. Yeah, they Chris. haven't had any more. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field and he's going to make the catch on the warning track a fine running play there for the first out. Ready once again a goose for the dirt bag left fielder goose first delivery to him on the way a fastball and he swings through it to fall behind. We're in the seventh inning now of a pitcher's duel two to one our score. And this is high, a ball and a strike. Thank 
Hey, He's on, set. Here comes the 1 1. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to 1 and 2 now. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 1 2. Here's a ball hit high in the air and fairly deep toward the right field corner. Trumbull is out near the wall as he pulls it in for the second out. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance, kept the opposition at bay, and Fans as a result, he's our top player First of the game. The MLB The Show has baseball coming your way on a summer night at Oriole Park in Baltimore. Tonight, game two of this three-game weekend series between the American League's Houston Astros and the Baltimore Orioles should see some great battles out of these two next on the show Dylan Bundy a right hander from the Sooner State gets the starting assignment here what do we need to know here Danny hey this guy has a four pitch repertoire right and those are a lot of nice options to have you can go hard soft you can go in and out and anytime you have four pitches if you can throw them for strikes you have the big advantage Harold one of your former uniforms the Orioles as they begin play here tonight fair to say they're not playing their best baseball right now losers of five of their last six well, they're coming off a tough loss. I mean, they played pretty good ball. They just lost by one yeah, run. But, you know, you, you look back at it, those are the ones that eat you up, those one-run loss games. A runner at first with no outs here. All right, come on now, one time. Get a piece. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. <laughs> Stepping in and ready for another shot. Goose. Dirtbag comes into this at bat 0 for 1 Dirtbag. in the ball game. Hit on the ground to short. Hardy's there. Throw won't be in time as he reaches it first. Digging in for his second at bat, Jose Altuve. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Jose Altuve. Ready on 1 and 2. And there he goes towards second. This is on the ground over to first. He'll go to the bag for 1. Evan Gaddis now standing in. Now 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Evan Gaddis. Now a look and a throw back to second. And the runner back safely. Come on now, rip it. Runner, runner, runner. Runner breaks for third. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Gentry has a beat on it. He's got it and there are two down now. And no tag at second. He'll head back there with two away now. Here's George Springer. These two have not faced each other at the major league level. George Springer. Runner! Runner goes for third. To short, hit hard. Hardy's up with it. Throw on to Davis, takes care of him, and that'll end the inning. So no. Ready for another chance. Now Goose batting. dirt bag. A hit in two oh, tries Goose. so far. Dirt bag. First delivery to him on the way. And this is hit hard to the right side. Oh. Foul. Now I'm sure these infielders know it, but this hitter can burn down the baseline. So if he puts a ground ball in play, the defense is going to have to make a perfect turn to turn two. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Oh, and this deflects right off him. The relay, and he is in there. Well, Matt, I thought it definitely had the height. It just didn't have the distance. The outfielder gives it a great effort, but it's just out of his reach. But he does get the ball back in quickly, holding him to a double. And now on 3-0, and they won't even bother to nibble at the corners as they'll just go ahead and put him aboard here. Riding in once again, Evan Gaddis. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. 3-2 with the bases loaded. Smoke toward third. The second for one. On to first. It's a double play as their woes can. Ready now. J.J. Hardy. Leading He'll start Oriole. things off in the Baltimore the sixth. J.J. Hardy. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Dirtbag sprinting after it. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. 
Well, in his defense, he did have to go a long way to get there, but that's not the problem. The problem is, once he arrives, he doesn't catch the dang ball. He knows as well as anybody that he should have brought that one in, and it's going to cost him an error. We'll see if the pitcher can... Here's the shortstop now, J.J. Hardy. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. J. The left center, dirtbag, moving to his left, makes the catch, but the runner from third breaks for home. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run's in to score from third. It's a 2-0 ball game. Digging in and looking for more, Craig Gentry. He steps in off a base hit in his last at-bat. Here's the 0-1. Swing and a looper to left. Dirtbag coming in, but he can't make the play as it finds the outfield grass. Well, we've always known this guy was a good hitter. You knew he was going to come out of it eventually. Here's another. Digging in once again. Goose, dirtbag. And then what's gone wrong for this lineup today? They're only three outs away from being shut out. Boy, you know, I just haven't seen a lot of fight in these at-bats. Now, of course, plenty of credit goes to that pitching. But the effort on the offensive side has been pretty lethargic watching from up here in the booth, Matt. Yeah, I would imagine it feels the same from watching in the stands in this one. Now the 0-1. And he's in front of a tight little slider that time. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings, big power swings. Now he's got to dial it back a little bit and try to put that ball in play. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Well, he didn't even break a sweat in this one. Three pitches, he gets the out and heads to the clubhouse to celebrate. Can't do much afternoon. better than that. This evening's first game finishes 2-0 the, the final Three score. Run. Six hits. Sunday afternoon baseball from Baltimore. Today it's the rubber match of this three-game series between the American League's Houston Astros and the Baltimore Orioles. Two of the game's best Two. overall talents, Dirt Altuve back. and Machado, next. And the first pitch is chopped foul right at home plate at strike one. Well, these Orioles entering play today, Harold Reynolds, they come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. And, Matt, you know, you look at their split right now, but they lost the first game one to second one, so you're looking at momentum is on their side. That's why I'm kind of leaning towards them here in this third game. Well, that's a great example of just pure hitting. Switch hitter takes the ball the other way. This is something they work on from both sides of the plate. Nice execution. Batting third, second baseman, Jose Altuve. Oh, and two count, here's the pitch. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Jones is after it. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Stepping into the box, Evan Gaddis. He comes in currently Gattis. second on the team Evan in home runs. Gattis. Tillman ready with a 1 2. Here's a high pop up. Davis is there for it. And that's the third out. So coming to the plate, Mark Batting Trumbo. Ball. Lifetime Mike versus Taylor. this arm. Over Mark five. Trumbo. 0 oh, and 1 count and the pitch. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Catch made in left. Here comes the runner for the plate. Now it's cut off. A throw to the plate. And he will score on the sacrifice fly as he's in with our first tally of the ball. Settling in now. Goose Dirtbag. Into the windup and the pitch. A swing and a miss at a ball down. With two outs, they're not playing him to bunt here, and he didn't show it there, but I wouldn't be surprised if he wasn't at least thinking about it. He handles the bat pretty well, and he can definitely run. Ball chopped foul here at the plate, and he's behind nothing in two. Two out, nobody on. And another foul ball. That's a nice job of standing alive. A two-strike breaking ball just out of the zone. He was able to put enough on it to get another pitch. On the ground to the right side. Backhanded. And he's safe. 
Well, that's plan within his game right there. The speedster gets a little infield single, and now he's on to do damage. Number 27, Jose Digging in, Altuve. Jose Altuve, 0 for 1 here in the early going. Goes up and gets it as this is bounced to shortstop. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Digging in now, Adam Jones. His career number numbers in this matchup, Adam one for four. Jones. Hit in the air out to left. Dirtbag giving chase, and the inning is over. Ready for another shot now. Goose, Dirtbag, a couple of singles to his credit thus far. Trying to hold the lead, here's the delivery. And this is fouled straight back. 0-1, here's the pitch. Oh, and this at bat is quickly moving from bad to worse. It's 0-2 now. For the most part, he's looked really locked in at the plate in this game. Not so much on that swing, though. 0-2, here it comes. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. Good pitch there on 0-2. Breaking ball out of the zone away. Might set up another breaking ball to see if he'll chase this one a little bit farther off the plate. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Well, he kind of got caught chasing the first two pitches out of the strike zone. But I think he's caught on to their game a little bit right now. Two tough pitches that he took with two strikes. And now the count is two and two. Wow, this is a pretty good at bat right here from down in the count 0 and 2 to work the count back to three and two. And he's seen a lot of pitches too. Chop fouled over towards the coaching box. Boy, and he just won't go away as he fights off another pitch and hits it foul right at the plate. Back to back changeups and fouled that one off right there. I don't think he's going to come back with the third one. I got to be thinking some other pitch is coming. On the eighth pitch of the at bat is the one that finally does it as he wears him down. Now at the plate, Adam Jones. 0 That's for 1 with a run 10. scored thus far. Adam Jones. Throw me a two ball right now. Let's go. And now a swing and a ball hit in the air out to left field. Dirtbag is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. And he will scurry back to first. As Digging in the switch hitter, Goose Dirtbag. He'll lead it off here as we begin dirtbag. inning number seven. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. That looked like he was cheating for that fastball inside right there. Early swing, got out in front of that off-speed pitch. Clearly looking for a fastball. right there. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Curveball that time, not even close. Ready on one and two. And he chased it in the dirt. Castillo has it. And the throw is in time. Dirtbag is retired. And standing in, Goose Dirtbag. Couple of singles for him in four trips for him this afternoon. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Ball chopped foul right at home plate, and it's 0 1. Oh, he looked like a caveman swinging a club on that one. It's 0-2 now. Really tied him up on that one. Yeah, clearly didn't recognize where that was going to end up, Matt. If I were pitching, I might go right back in there. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses 1-2. and two. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Hey, get your pitch right up there, huh? Let's go, kid. Let's go, kid. Here we go. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. Well, the lineup was clicking for him in this contest, and the man you see there was a major...
Time for baseball on the show from the bank. Citizens Bank Park in Philadelphia. Tonight, game two of this three-game series between the American League's Houston Astros and the Philadelphia Phillies. It's Phillies baseball next on the Maybe show. Tonight for Houston, left fielder, Goose Dirtbag. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. These Phillies, Harold, as they enter play here tonight, four and two over their last six games, including a win last time out. Well, Matt, they're two and two on the home stand, so obviously you don't want to go two and three if you lose this game here. Three and two, though. The win today gets you shooting towards maybe a nice little winning streak. That's why this game is important to me. Squared that one up just a little late. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. The next 0-2 misses, and that'll move it to one and two now. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Come on, big guy. And Ooh, that misses two and two. You can bet these hitters are taking note of what the guy on the hill is working with. A long at bat like this in the first That's inning right can reveal a lot. He's set. Here's the two two. Breaking pitch is swung on and hit fouled over to the right side. Another 2-2 offering. Again, he sends it out of play. Neither guy given in. Here's the next one. And this is popped up. Back behind second. Blanco will stay with it as he backs up and puts it away. One gone. Now here's a look at the Astros starting lineup. Who are you focused on, Dan Fleszak? Riding into the box, Cesar Hernandez. Not the shiniest of batting average as he comes in hitting down in the 220s for the year. Swung on and hit in the air to left. Dirtbag comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first out. Digging in to try it again. Goose Dirtbag. He'll stand in to open things up here in the third. Bunt attempt here as he gets this one down. Throw to first will get him as they pounce on it quickly to snuff out the bunt attempt. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Cesar Hernandez. Second base 0 for 1 for him here in this Cesar one. Hernandez. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. But he's going to get there as he runs it down on the warning track for the second out of the inning. Striding in once again, Goose for the Dirtbag. Astros. He'll start Left things fielder. out as we begin the Dirt fifth. Bag. First offering on its way. Popped high in the air, calling for it. Franco, one away. So stepping in, Roman Quinn. Well, he singled his last time up. Roman 50th Quinn. pitch of the game on its way. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Dirt bag over to his right, and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Ready for another chance? Now Goose dirt bag. Left fielder. Goose dirt bag. Oh, and a hearty cut there to begin the at bat. It's nothing in one. The wind up and the 0 1. A swing and a miss just out in front of that fastball. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings. Big power swings. Now he's got a swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Wow, that's a rarity. A one nothing game in baseball these days. Awfully well. It's a shame.
with the skyline in front of us, a look at Citizens Bank Park here in Philadelphia. Tonight we wrap up Michael Marriott, the California-born right-hander, is on the mound. Harold, what do you got? Well, Matt, when you look back at his last outing and go through the box score, you see five walks. Leading off tonight that, for to me, is what he's got to cut down if he has a chance to win this game. Fast. Sends that one out of play for strike one. These Phillies, Harold, as they enter play here tonight, they come off another loss last time out, and in fact, they've dropped three of their last four. Yeah, man, I mean, it's been a little bit of up and down inconsistency. I mean, they're two and three in this homestand. Haven't played solid baseball, but they got a chance to get to the 500 mark with a win in this game right here. And then after that, who knows? Maybe get on a nice streak. Well, he's going to come after you with the breaking ball, it looks like today. First batter, he's already thrown two curveballs. He's got himself ahead in the count. This could be a breaking ball game for him. And he's going to try for three right out of the chute tonight. And he'll get there as he kicks off the ball game with a triple. You don't really expect a leadoff hitter, especially a rookie, to hit for power, but he blasts this thing. And when he rounds first, he's thinking triple all the way. And those young legs helped him get there, too. Batting second here tonight, center fielder, number four, George. High Green. in the air out to center field. Herrera's there. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. And he will score on the sacrifice fly as he's in with our first tally of the ballgame. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Goose, dirtbag. Dirtbag. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A fastball that just misses inside. Shot toward right center. And he dives to make a spectacular catch. What? Now at the plate, Brian Holliday. He'll lead it off against Lance McCullers. Brian Holiday. This is hit high in the air out to left field. Did he catch that? He did. What a play there for the first out. Oh, and a highlight real catch there, no doubt. He laid out to sacrifice his body, brought it in. See it, drive it. Like Digging in once now again, batting. Goose Durbag, one Goose. for two with a Dirt triple bag. so far in this one. Just got a piece of it as it's fouled back. One run, five hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Astros to this point. Let's fly. Let's go right here. Swing and a miss, and he's quickly in the hole 0-2. Oh, wow, what makes it so tough to be a hitter is to be able to hit and change his speeds, right? You're geared up for the fastball, and all of a sudden, he pulls the string and throws you the straight change, the dreaded equalizer. Right, one and two. And a wasted pitch there, one, one and two. Up. Hey, I know you have to protect the strike zone when you get the count to two strikes, but on an 0-2 pitch that misses by that much, it's pretty easy for a hitter not to swing at that one. Ball two. Hey, let it fly up there, huh? Pulled toward right center field. Chasing after it is Herrera, but he's not going to get there, and he's headed for extra bases again. And the run's going to come into score from second as they grab a 2 to nothing lead now. Here's George Springer. He hit a sack fly earlier. Number four, George Springer. He's set. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Saunders is under it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Now at the plate, Brian Holliday comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Holliday. Two quick strikes, and now the 0-2. And this is in the air now, out to left. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends. Here's Howie Kendrick. He's hoping to avoid the hat trick. He struck out in each left of his fielder. first two plate appearances Howie so far. Kendrick. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Dirtbag is there. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Digging in and looking for more. Goose, dirtbag. Bats here with a Goose. double and a triple on his line in this one. 
First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Wait for a good one. Drive it, kid. Now here's the pitch. Line towards center field. Pereira is there now, and he has it. Two gone. Third baseman, number seven, Michael Franco. Hit in the air out to straightaway left field. Dirtbag moves over. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Phillies. And that'll bring in Tommy Joseph. First baseman, no hits in three 19. tries so far. He struck Tommy out once. Joseph. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. Ready for another shot now. Goose Dirtbag. He's tripled and doubled in four trips in the ball game. I couldn't lay off the pitch inside. It's 0-1. I'll tell you, if I'm pitching right now, I'm not throwing anything near the strike zone until these guys prove they can lay off it. They're just being way too aggressive. Here's the 0-1. Over towards the dugout, but this one will get into the stands. He's clearly looking to hit off the fastball and adjust. That's a pretty good swing after seeing two. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will. Fans are final. Friday night baseball on the show and we come your way from the Motor City of Detroit Michigan tonight the first of this three game weekend series between the American League's Houston Astros and the Detroit Tigers should see some great battles out of these two next on the show Jordan Zimmerman will be on the mound for the series opener what do we need to know here HR. Well, Matt, he's coming off an outing where he couldn't get out of the fifth inning. You know, fifth inning is that deciding inning for any pitcher. He was so frustrated he couldn't get through the fifth. And to make it worse and compound the matter, he got the loss. So this outing right here, if he's able to dig deep, that we'll see him pitch well. Tonight. Left fielder. Goose. Ready now. Dirt Goose 
dirt bag. He begins play in this one with his batting average over the 310 plateau. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. Harold, these Tigers, as they begin play here tonight, well, they've been playing some pretty good baseball, five and two over their last seven. Well, Matt, that 500 is like the magic number. Now they won their last game, now they're one under 500. If you get the 500, you feel like, okay, now we can start to build something special. But you got to get to that 500 mark. That's why this game is so important. They win today, they're at 500. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Ball, that's and high. a fastball just a bit up. Bases are empty, one man out. And this pitch is hit foul off to the left and out of play, so the count goes to two and two now. Two and two count, here it comes. And a and neck high ball. fastball that time. Jose Altuve will be next. Saws him off here as this ball's popped into the air. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. And he takes ball four, so he's on. And as you know, that often means the steal could be in order here. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. And he's got that batting lineup near the 300 mark entering play. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. And it skips in as he steals the bag easily. The 0-1 shoots this one over to first. Glove by Cabrera, and he'll take this one to the bag for the out. But meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. Evan Gaddis now standing four. in. The average Catcher. for him entering play, Evan not far Gaddis. north of 200. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Upton is there and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there. Here's the second baseman, Ian Kinsler. As we take a look there at the difference in his numbers between June and July. And now here's Kinsler with a drive high and deep to left field. A leap at the wall, but he can't bring this one back. It's a home run. As we take a look at the pitch location here. Riding in once again, Goose Dirtbag. First pitch of the at bat. Hit sharply on the ground. Kinsler's there for it. Throw in time, and the side is retired. One gone here in the Detroit third. And that'll bring in the second baseman, Ian Kinsler. Ian Kinsler. Ready with the 0 2. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Dirtbag is there, and he makes the catch for the second out. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying. Here's Justin Upton now. Lifetime Thomas history Miller, with Colin eight. McHugh. Just Justin a two for 14 Upton. line to show for it. He also has one home run. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Dirtbag moves over to gone. Nick Castellanos now. He's all for one Number thus nine. far. Nick Castellanos. Ready on one and two. And this is in the air now out to left. Dirtbag is there. He makes the play and that'll end the inning. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Tyler Collins comes into this Center at bat Gilder. 0 for 1 in the Tyler ball game. Collins. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And he will run this one down, moving to his right, and that's the first out of the inning. Up Ready for, for another Tigers. chance? James yes, McCann. Sir. Lifetime James history McCann. with Colin McHugh. Not great. He's one for eight. Fly ball to straightaway left. Dirtbag is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for out number two. Digging in once again, Goose Dirtbag, 0 for 1 for him here in this one. First delivery to him on the way. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Now, I'm sure these infielders know it, but this hitter can burn down the baseline, so if he puts a ground ball in play, 
the defense is going to have to make a perfect turn to turn two. Well, he's having a good amount of success here, Dan, even though he hasn't really gotten a ton of swings and misses. Yeah, but for him, Matt, he's more of a pitch-to-contact kind of guy, and obviously it's working so far. And the way he pitches, it really... The first baseman, Miguel Cabrera, stands in. Been a rough go of things at the plate for him so far, but his guys are looking for him to change that right here. Yeah, nothing better than coming through for the boys in a tight game, Matt, especially when you're kind of due to do something productive. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Gone! A two-run shot that gives them the lead. Digging in to try it again. Goose, for the dirt bag. 0 for 2 with a walk for him so far. Dirt bag. Here we go with inning number nine as the first pitch misses for ball one. Let her rip, let her rip. Up top, it's 2-0. You know, sometimes it takes a pitcher a few pitches to get going, but those two pitches weren't even close. Falls behind in the count, 2-0. Oh, it's time to start getting locked in. Here he comes on 2-0. and oh. And not the kind of swing you're hoping for on 2-0 and oh as they bunch him up inside. It's 2-1 and one now. Oh, wow. That's what they call a jam sandwich. Wow. Not much you can do with that pitch that's in tight. Let's go, big fella. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. And another foul ball. Well, he's out in front of that changeup. I tell you what, he had the honor of the fastball. The fastball, the pitch before and back with the changeup, that's a great combination. He's set. Here's the 2-2. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. And the throw will indeed take care of him for the first down. Here's the second baseman, Ian Kinsler. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one-for-four day. Ian Kinsler. A drive to left. Get out of here. Get out of here. Gone. They win it. Santa Maria. And guys, time to recognize the man who really stood out this afternoon, and there he is, Ian Kinsler. He's our tops player of the game. Hey, he was one of a few guys. MLB The Show has sent down Detroit. Tonight, game two of this three-game weekend series between the American League's Houston Astros and the Detroit Tigers. Mickey and Altuve look to lead their clubs to victory next. Digging in the switch in the hitter, Goose Dirtbag. He's hitting just above Goose. the banner 300 Dirtbag. mark on the season coming into this one. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Harold, these Tigers as they begin play here tonight, they've been playing some pretty good baseball of late as they've won six of their last eight games. Well, Matt, we're watching a team that won the last game, put them at 500. Now, they're not where they want to be, and they're still several games back in the division. But well, you just keep pushing one day at a time, and you never know if you might be able to gain some ground. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Another one-two delivery. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this will land foul, shy of the wall. That is the fourth foul ball of this A.B. right here. He's seeing a lot of pitches. Lifted the other way to left center. Upton on the move. And he tracks it down. A nice running play to record this. Leading off for the Tigers, number five, second baseman, Ian Hinsler. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Dirtbag looking up. Out of here into the visitors' bullpen. Well, it's obvious they didn't change their spot. Leading off for the Tigers. Designated the windup and the 0-2 pitch. Star, That's lifted the other way out to left. 
dirt bag. Has to retreat a bit, but he gets there for route number one. So striding in, well, Goose dirt bag. 0 for Goose. 1 here in the early dirt going. Bag. Good swing. Just got to try and straighten that one out. Ball nope. one. That's inside. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Lifted the other way out to left center. Collins is in pursuit. And that's the second out of the inning. Now at the plate, Victor Martinez. The He's 0 for 1 thus far. Victor Martinez. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Calling for it, dirtbag. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Now at the plate, Goose Dirtbag. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Goose Dirtbag. And this no, one's not no. close. It's in the dirt for ball one. And now pitch on the way. Squared that one up just a little late. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your yeah, wheelhouse, right, and you right. foul it off. On the run, this one in on him, and he can't connect, so he finds himself down one and two now. Two things pitchers really love, called strike threes and jamming hitters. How about that? Talk about that jam right there. That's about as good as it gets. Well, when you're hitting with two strikes, you're just in battle mode. Right there, he gets a breaking ball. He just fouled it off. Got a piece of it and stays alive. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Astros go down. Ready once again. Leading off Goose, dirtbag. No fielder. hits in three tries Goose. so far. He struck dirtbag. out once. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. Chopped foul at the plate here, and it's 0-2. I think a big reason why he's been so effective in this one that he's been just about getting ahead of every hitter. Seems like every one of them are 0-2, 1-2, and, and it's just about every at bat. And when that's the case, your chances of getting a good pitch to hit are way worse. Here's another 0-2. Oh, and he dusted Uh-oh. him off the plate that he's time. Go, Some man. mind he's games good. being played now. It's 1-2. and two. Well, it's been a good outing so far, but he hasn't really racked up the strikeout totals that you might think, Dan. Yeah, it amazes me how every game you pitch can be so different, Matt. Sometimes it feels like guys can't touch you and you're just punching everyone out. But other times, you don't have your good stuff and you really rely on movement and location to get outs. That's been the case for him today, and it's really working. Tell you what, his spot has been the outside pitch right there, and now we're late in the game, and he continues to pound the outside pitch, and it's really working out for him. And that's through for a hit. So it's a leadoff knock to start out the inning as they'll try to claw back at that three-run deficit. The second baseman, number 20. Digging in and looking for more, Jose Altuve. Two base hits, both singles to this point. Hit on the ground out to short. Only play will be to first, so with the runner in motion, they stay out of the double play. And now they'll put the tag on the run. And tonight's ends as a 3-0 shutout win. Michael Fulmer earns his eighth victory of the season. Afternoon baseball for your viewing pleasure on a fine Sunday afternoon from Comerica Park in Detroit. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend series between the American League's Houston Astros and the Detroit Tigers. Miggy and Altuve look to lead their clubs to victory next. Now a bunt attempt here, and he'll make the quick basket catch behind the plate so the bunt attempt doesn't pan out. Digging in for his second at bat. Goose dirt bag. He'll start things out here in a tie ball game. First pitch of the inning is taken low and away for a ball. It's 1 0. And the pitch. Inside corner, a ball and a strike.
One and one. Here it comes. A wave and a miss. A tick behind a good fastball. I really like his game plan. You can clearly see his game plan was I'm going to bust him inside. And he's done that. And we're already in the third inning. It continues to pound the ball in. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away. So now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. And that slider's almost in the dirt. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. And this is pop foul, but perhaps playable behind first. And Cabrera will take this one for the first out. Striding into the box, Tyler Collins took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. Tyler Collins. That's lifted the other way out to left. Dirtbag giving chase. Down. Here's the shortstop now, Jose shortstop, Iglesias. Comes into this Jose at bat 0 for Iglesias. 1 in the ballgame. This one's flipped toward left. Dirtbag ranging. And he's got it. A great play for out number two. Ready for another shot now. J.D. Martinez. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Pulled high in the air out to left field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away. And that in. So digging in now. Goose Dirtbag. He'll start the inning. And we're back to the top of the order. But they haven't looked too dangerous in this one yet. Right, guys? Well, none of them have any hits yet, so you're right on the money. They've done a great job of holding these guys down so far. Another opportunity for him here, so we'll see if anything changes. Squared that one up just a little late. Some action now in the Tigers' bullpen as they'll get a left-hander and a right-hander up to throw. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one-and-two hole. Oh, he was right on that one. A breaking ball right in his wheelhouse. He just, oh, man, he had good timing. And that misses two and two. Now that's that old school slider right there trying to get in on his hands. We see that with a cutter a lot, but the slider's even more effective because you can't pick up the spin. And this is heading out toward left field, but this is going to get fouled up into the crowd. Here's the pitch on two and two. Swing at a high pop-up straight back, though it looks as though he'll have room back there. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. Into the box, Goose the fielder, Dirtbag. And he throws the fastball by him here, 0 and 1. He broke out the slide step there, Danny. Yeah, he's clearly thinking about the steal right here. Didn't happen, but the cat mouse game continues on. And a good job to lay off the fastball there, close, but it's 1 and 1. Ready with the 1-1 pitch. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. As a hitter, you know the pitcher's trying to work you down around the knees in a double play situation, so making him get a pitch up and actually in the zone is a must. Now a ball hit pretty well the left, but this is going to wind up in the seats foul. Again, a 1-2. Swing and a miss on the fastball that
time out number two. Yeah, that's the way you want to finish a three-game home series, breaking out the brooms and sweeping the other guys. Tuesday night baseball now from the home of the Astros, Minute Maid Park in Houston. Standing in, Evan Longoria. He's entering play in this one, a home run shy of 20 for the season. The 2 1 home to Longoria. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag retreats to the track and he'll put this one away. So was. Now with the plate, Goose Dirtbag. It'll lead things Leading off here the in the bottom half of the first. Left fielder, Goose Dirtbag. Sends that one out of play for strike one. And Harold, as we take a look at the Rays entering play here tonight, they come in not exactly setting the world on fire as they've dropped five of their last eight ball games. Yeah, last game they just didn't play well. They gave up a lot of runs, really sloppy. So when you play that sloppy, you're not going to win games. Fastball swung on and grounded out towards second. Gordon is there, and he's retired here one away. Now at the plate, Logan Morrison comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. Logan Morrison. Swing and a looper to left. He lays out for it, but he can't pull it in. Well, that's a perfect example of taking a ball inside out. You know, you hear that terminal. In is the third baseman, Evan third Longoria. Baseman, 0 for 1 Evan here in the Longoria. early going. Comes set with the 0 and 1. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Dirtbag is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the. Come on now. Digging one in to time. try it again. Uh, Goose Dirtbag. 0 for fielder. 1 for him here in this Goose. one. Dirtbag. Here's a swing and a high pop-up. Longoria is there for it. And he makes the catch for the second out. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Him. Goose Dirtbag. Two Goose. men on, two away dirtbag. here in the fourth. In the dirt here. So now two men in scoring position. Four runs, seven hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Astros to this point. That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. That's a nice pitch right there. He threw him a breaking ball, comes back with the fastball, and now he's late. Now he doesn't know how to adjust. He's kind of caught in between. you got him set up perfectly. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. His pitch count is getting up there in the inning now. He needs to get this frame over with sooner than later, so forcing contact and getting the defense involved is probably the best thing he can do. To two and two now. Never tempted to swing at that ball down low. It's ball three. You know, guys, these hitters have had some great looks at that slider so far. And clearly, they're all on the same page. 
The plan is simple. Lay off that slider and make him bring up something straight in the strike zone. He's set. Here's the three and two. And he misses with it for ball four. So the bases will be loaded now with two away. Striding in once again, Carlos Correa. Eighth batter of the inning now with the bases loaded and two away. Looking to put him away. Here's the 0-2. Now a ball lifted high in the air towards shallow right center field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away. And that ends the... Ready for another shot now. Evan Longoria. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag has to retreat to the track, but he has it. Ready for another chance? Matt Duffy. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. Matt Duffy. Popped up. Correa is there for it. Two down. Stepping into the box, Michael McHenry. We'll see if he can come through in a clutch Michael spot here. McHenry. Two on, two out here in inning number six. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag ranging back, but he has no chance to make the play. It's off the wall. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. And the second run will score as that lead has evaporated. Digging in once again, Goose Dirtbag. He'll Left start things out here in the bottom Goose. of inning number seven. Dirtbag. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Well, these hitters can expect to see a heavy dose of that big fastball from this reliever. It's a major part of his arsenal. Well, I think his eyes lit up when he saw that pitch coming up at his eye level. <laughs> yeah, good luck. But hey, a high fastball all, all of a sudden becomes really dangerous for a pitcher if it's not spotted above the zone. A little height difference makes all the difference. And this is fouled at the plate. Here's one that misses inside, and the count's run full now. Three and two. Time to focus here. This game is way too close to be walking, guys, so we'll see if he can make him swing the bat on this next pitch. And that misses ball four. It's a leadoff walk to start the home seventh. The batter number one, shortstop. So stepping in, Carlos, Carlos Correa. Correa. Lifetime against this particular arm. A three-for-five line to show for those meetings. Souza ranging back to the track. He makes the catch, a great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. The second baseman. So a runner at first now with one Jose away. And striding Altuve. in the speedy second baseman, Jose Altuve. Right side, hit hard. And there's his first base hit in this one. And they'll have runners at the corners following the one-out single. Well, it took him till the seventh, but he gets his first hit of the game here, and that'll extend his hitting streak. Yeah, Center seventh fielder. inning, you're thinking maybe Shore. one more at bat Banger. if his team rallies, so this was a big hit. Meanwhile here, this ball's given a pretty good ride out to deep left field, and that is going to clear the wall. A home run. So a three-run blast is straight away left. Number 18 for him on the campaign, and they double him up. It's eight to four. Eight four tonight. The Strohs blasted five home runs in route to victory. Michael Feliz gets the win in relief, his sixth of the season. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. From Southeast Texas, we welcome you inside Minute Maid Park here in downtown Houston. Now to the plate, Goose Dirtbag. He'll lead things off here throw. in the bottom half of the first. Left fielder, Goose Dirtbag. Purple looked at here for strike one. And Harold, as we take a look at the Rays entering play here tonight, they come in in the midst of a stretch where they've dropped six of their last nine. Yeah, last game, they just didn't play well. They gave up a lot of runs, really sloppy. So when you play that sloppy, you're not going to win games. 
Coming to the plate now, Logan Morrison comes into play with a batting average in the respectable 270s. Logan There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag going back on it into the Crawford boxes and gone. Batting seven, shortstop, Matt Duffy. Left field and deep. Dirtbag looking up, gone as it's into the Crawford boxes. Wow, not every call is going to go your way. There are... Digging in for his second at bat, right. Billy Burns. Fielder, Lifetime history Billy with Colin Burns. McHugh. He's gone just two for 15. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And that is just shy of the box seats off the top of the wall. And he is in the second with a two-out double. So coming to the plate, now Goose batting. Dirtbag. 0 for 1 here Goose. in the early going. Dirtbag. And he waves at a curveball there. No balls and a strike. Well, that's a true indicator he's looking for a fastball in. He wanted to spin the wind right there and knock one as far as he could. He got the off-speed pitch inside, and he pulled off of it. Little dribbler down the line. That goes foul. Two strikes on him now. Come on, big guy. Two quick strikes, and now the 0-2. There's a high foul ball as it finds a lucky fan in the upper deck for a souvenir. That fastball straightens him up a bit. One and two now. Here's the one and two. Now a flare out to left center, and that's going to fall for a base hit. Wallstrom rounds third and is digging for the plate, and that'll put him on the board as it's now a 5-1 ball game. And they will tag him out between first and second. Ready once again, Steven right Souza comes in one for Steven two with that home Sousa. run he hit earlier. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag racing back. He jumps, but he can't make the play. It's off the wall. And he's in there easily at second with a one-out double. Digging in the switch hitter, now Billy batting. Burns. Two Left for fielder. three with a double on Billy his line so Burns. far. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Dirtbag is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. Hey, let's go, big Digging in now, Leading Goose Dirtbag. He's one Left for two fielder. in the ball game. Dirtbag. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. That was a first pitch fastball. He just blew it right by him. You talk about an overpowering fastball working today. He's got a good one going. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. And he'll get over to me. Oh, it kicks off his glove. How did he do that? The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Uh, they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Now batting, a Goose for the Dirtbag. Left fielder, Goose Dirtbag. First pitch of the at-bat. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. You know what I've been impressed with? He's really used that fastball to his advantage, and he's recognized the fact he's throwing it by people. So he's continued to dominate with that heater and not check off of it much. Hey, come on, big guy. Get your pitch. Keeping it down here as it's to one and two. That swing had one purpose, and that was to put the ball over the wall. I guess he doesn't have much to lose with his team down this many at this point in the game. Chop fouled over towards the coaching box. Your big trolley, huh?
Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a two-seamer, and the inning is over. So striding forward now, Brad Miller. Although there are a couple of bases open, and we'll see if they think about working around him. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag racing back. But he can't get it as it's off the wall. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run from third is in to score. Digging in, Wilson Ramos. He's looking for his third hit of the ball game here. Wilson Ramos. Hey, don't be out now. From the belt, the pitch. Oh, and he gets a hold of this one as it's in the air to deep left. Does he have another one? He does. It's another home run. Here's D. Gordon now. And Dan, after that home run, well, it means, looks like they might be able to end means. this losing streak D. that they've been mired Gordon. in. Yeah, and a win at this level feels really good, especially when it's been a while. They're on their way if they can play well the rest of the game. Dirtbag is there, and he'll make the catch to return. Hey, now, Larry. Stepping in, Goose Dirtbag. Left fielder, Goose Dirtbag. Hey, see it, drive it like you can. Let's go. Here's the first pitch to him. High in the air out to center field. On the move is Kiermaier. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. And the Rays' offense tonight was led by the exploits of this man, the Wilson Ramos. Strike a pose. He's our top Ray. player of the game. Nine runs on 15 yeah, he hits. certainly was a big One part error. of this victory. They left Picked four up four RBIs in the game, so it's safe to say that he well, came through when they needed him to. runs on 13 hits. No errors. They left four men on base. Now from the Lone Star State in Houston, Texas, nighttime baseball from beautiful Minute Maid Park. Tonight, the finale of this four-game set between the Tampa Bay Rays and the Houston Astros. These two should provide some big-time fireworks. First pitch is coming up. In is the third baseman, Evan Longoria. He also had three hits in the win last night. Evan Longoria. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Lifted in the air out to left field. Oh, and he misses it. And they're going to take a one nothing lead as the run comes across to score. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. Into the box now. Goose Dirtbag. It'll lead things off here Astros. in the bottom half of the first. Left fielder, dirtbag. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 1. And Harold, as we take a look at the Rays entering play here tonight, they come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. Yeah, Matt, the series didn't start the way they wanted to. Clearly, you lose the first two games, then you win yesterday. That's why a win today gives you a split. You salvage the series. One ball, two and he'll down. take the fastball here inside off the plate. It's one and two. And he got him. Ready now, Billy Burns. Now 0 for batting. 1 for him here in right this one. Fielder. Billy Into Burns. the windup. Here's the 2 and 1 pitch. Lifted in the air to straightaway left. Moving under it, dirtbag. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. At the plate, Goose Dirtbag. 0 for 1 here fielder. in the early going. Goose First offering dirtbag. on its way. And here's a ball hit in the air. And that'll slice just foul at the last moment. Hey, be patient, be patient, get yours. Swing and a miss, and he needs a little discipline here, 0 and 2. Well, there's no doubt what he was thinking on those first two swings, big power swings. Now he's got to dial it back a little bit and try to put that ball in play. This one's blooped out toward right center field. Gordon backs up and takes care of it, two away. Now in the box, Evan Longoria. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Evan Longoria. The shift will be of little importance here as this is lifted in the air out to left field. Dirtbag comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first out. I see it. Stepping up now, Goose 
dirt Left bag fielder. as he'll look to bring home that tying Left run from second with a base hit into the outfield. And that swung on and missed for strike one. Well, he's got himself a little bit of a jam right here, Matt. He's got two on, nobody out. Look, I want to get a double play hey, ball. Just okay. pitch the contact, get the double play here. Now the 0-1. And that's lifted the other way out to left. Dickerson's there. And that's the first out of the inning. Into the box now, Evan Longoria. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Here comes the payoff pitch. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag is back to the warning track, and he's able to put it away for the second out. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about it. Standing in, Kevin Kiermeyer. Career numbers against Will Harris. Hitless in three at bats. Kiermeyer. Hey, come on, guys. Here's the 01. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dirtbag going back. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. Wow, talk about a guy getting hot. Striding into the box. Goose Dirtbag. He'll try and get something started in the home half of the seventh. Ball one. Hey, wait till they off that one. Get out, kid. Come on, big dog. Get your pitch. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. A fastball that just misses inside. Boy, you don't see that very often out of a rookie. That's a 2 0 count, and both of those pitches were really close. This guy has a pretty good eye. Just a tick behind for a strike. Into the windup, here's the 2 and 1 pitch. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Kiermeyer ranging back at the track and this will find the wall out near the visitors bullpen and he is in to third with a leadoff triple every coach will tell you when you're down by two you don't want to take too many chances on the base pass regardless he hustles into third for the triple now and the batting. tying run is coming to the plate here's george springer sure. and it looks like this could be a critical at bat in this one well a glance at my scorebook shows they haven't been able to get him out yet so this could be a fun at bat to watch burns has it and I'd be surprised if they send the runner but not in time as the run scores and the lead is trying to pick things up where we left off Goose Dirtbag as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third and ball four here on the intentional walk so now they'll have a force at any base with two gone into the box George Springer He's off to a fast start in this one. Two for two, including a home run. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. And he comes back to get him. So a great job pitching out of it with the... Set to start. Here's D. Gordon now. He'll be the one to lead it off here in the top of inning number 10. D. O. one here's the pitch. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Moving under it, dirtbag, one away. Digging in, Billy Burns. His right lifetime numbers number with 14. Tony Sip. He's gone Billy two for six. Burns. One down. Here's one the down. one and one pitch. This one's flared out toward left. Dirtbag sprinting after it. He gets there and makes a fine running play for the second out. Hey, Stepping into the box, there, huh? Goose Dirtbag. Goose Dirtbag. Here Here's the first pitch. Oh, that one deflects off him. I think it got his arm. Thankfully, he's able to recover, and he gets the second out at first. Here's the catcher, Wilson Ramos. Catcher, Already a pair of long balls on Wilson his line in this one, so Ramos. we'll see what else he has in store here. Oh, and he gets a hold of this one as it's in the air to deep left. Does he have another one? He does. It's another home run. Goose dirtbag. Has just clubbed a mutt. So striding in, Goose Dirtbag. Goose. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Thought he had the inside corner that time, but it missed for ball one.
That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. See it, drive it. Let's go. Right here. Lifted the other way out to left center. Kiermaier giving chase. And he makes the catch for the second out. Tight one, seven to six, the final score tonight. The Rays get the win on the heels of four home runs. Alex Colome earns his third win of the year in relief. So that's a wrap here tonight for my partners in the booth, Harold Reynolds and Dan Plezak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for the more, click on over to the shownation.com. downtown Houston, Texas on a Saturday night in Minute Maid Park. Tonight, game two of this three-game weekend series between the Toronto Blue Jays and the Houston Astros. Looking forward to this matchup, and it's next on MLB Network. A left-hander out of Oklahoma will be on the mound. What do you have for us on him, H? Well, Matt, I, I love watching this guy pitch. I went back, looked at the video of his last game. He pitched into the sixth inning, threw the ball great, had electric stuff when he needed to, pitched out of some tough jams, and pitched well enough to get the W. So I think we'll see tonight really firsthand what kind of pitcher he is. We'll get to see it firsthand. Into the box now. Goose dirtbag. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Lays off 1 0. Harold, as the Jays take the field here tonight, they come into this one in decent form as despite the loss last time out, they've won six of their last nine. Yeah, Matt, they've been a little up and down on this road trip, a little inconsistent, but 2 and 2 is not bad, better than being 0 4. They win this game today, though, and it really kind of turns the tide for them a bit. Well, he's going to come after you with the breaking ball, it looks like today. First batter, he's already thrown two curveballs, he's got himself ahead in the count. This could be a breaking ball game for him. Seared down the first baseline. He'll take it to the bag himself, and the leadoff man is gone here to start the home first. Ready for another chance? Goose dirt bag. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Inside with the fastball, it's 1 and 0. Right here. A oh, pretty healthy hack that time. It's one and one. In front of the change up there is this is chopped foul at home plate. Hey, come on, big dog. Ready to deliver the one and two. Hot shot on the ground is short. Reined in. On to Pierce at first, and the inning is over. And that'll bring up the speedy now Devin batting. Travis. Second baseman. He's 0 for 1 thus Devin far. Travis. Here's a shot to left field and deep. Look at this. It's up and out of here into the archway. Ready for another shot now. Goose 
dirtbag. He'll start Leading the inning, the and Astros. we're back to the top of the order, Not but they haven't looked too dangerous in this one yet. Right, guys? Well, none of them have any hits yet, so you're right on the money. They've done a great job of holding these guys down so far. Another opportunity for him here, so we'll see if anything changes. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Had him fooled there as this is lifted in the air out to left center and shallow. Upton is camped under this one, and he puts it away for the first down. Striding in once again, Goose Dirtbag. Goose Dirtbag. First pitch of the at-bat. A fastball and he swings through it to fall behind. Well, now they got the tie run at first base. Now it's going to take a ball in the gap to really hey, score this right guy here. from first base. And I'm really curious how they're going to defend that on a relay throw and maybe if we have a play or not. But you got to hit one in the gap to get there first. Here's one that misses high. It's one and one. Hey, square one up. One time. Here it comes on one and one. Way out in front. Beautiful changeup. Got him out front with that swing right there. That's what a changeup will do. Just keep you off balance. Yeah, we need you right here. One time. Swing and a soft liner. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Here comes the right fielder, Jose Batista. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Jose Batista. Left field and deep. Dirtbag ranging back. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Digging in to try it again. Kendry's Morales. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Morales. Chases one up the ladder as this is hit in the air to left field. Dirtbag will get there with ease as he puts it away for out number two. Russell Martin now. No hits the in two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. Martin. The 0-1 home to Martin. Got a lot of it out to deep left. Dirtbag going back on it. And what a play. A beautiful jumping catch to put an end to the inning. One more time. Full extension in left field as he hauls this one in. Don't touch that remote. More on MLB Network. Well, everyone was treated to a really well-played ball game in this one, and the guy you see there turned in a particularly notable performance, so he's our top's player of the game.